Jordan River is holy to half of humanity. You cannot read the scriptures without all kinds of references to the Jordan River. The reality is that many people who live along this river don't experience its benefits. In many parts of its flow, it's dirty, polluted, uh, it disappears in dry seasons of the year. Echo Peace Middle East is a really inspiring organization. We bring people together from Israel, Jordan, and Palestine. We bring them together on issues of water and environment. We come together and we use environment as a platform for peace building. Water is a basic part of our life and when, by joining together to rehabilitate shared water streams like the Lower Jordan River, we gain a lot, not only for the environment but also to learn about each other, about our different faith communities and about how we can help each other to rehabilitate our shared ecosystems. The work of the Eco Peace Institute is to gather people on both sides of the river from different faith traditions and in neighboring communities to advocate and to work for improvement of the water situation, uh, to understand each other's needs, and, and they, they come to understand each other as friends in doing that work, and it is it's true peace-building work. It, it is a deeply important issue to our faith. Uh, and the disappearance uh, uh, of the Jordan River, uh, I think, would be tragic. And obviously, it means so much to the life of people on both sides of the Jordan River. We've created a toolkit of resources for Jewish, Christian, and Muslim communities called uh, Water and Ecology in the Jordan River. And in this toolkit, you'll find all the resources your community might need to create a whole educational program about how your faith-based community can engage on this issue. We bring together the great songbook of the Jordan River, the literature about the Jordan River, amazing essays that have been contributed by Christian and Muslim and Jewish leaders, all in the effort to rehabilitate this river together. Water knows no border, but in this area of the world, water can bring us together because water does not see all of these walls and borders that we put between each other.